ClickUp tutorial how to communicate with your team members. Hi guys, welcome back. Today I'm going to be showing you how you can use ClickUp and create different tasks and then communicate with your team member to get more productive and save time. So let's get started. The link for ClickUp is given in the description down below. You can go ahead and check it out right now. So once you sign into ClickUp, then we know we can create a task. But we can also communicate with our team and let them know all the updates and what they have to do next. So let's open this task. The best way to communicate with your team is through comments. We can add different comments to any of our tasks that we create. Click on comment right here and now I will be able to assign a comment to a person and write whatever I want. Let's go ahead and ask them to approve the task. Now, if I want to mention a person, I can go ahead and mention them with an ad. Select ad and then you have to enter their name. We can search different team members from here and I can select this one. Now, I have mentioned a person and they will be notified when I will add this comment to a task. Similarly, I can go ahead and add an assignee to this comment as well. So, I'm going to go ahead and assign it to this person again and they will also be notified and they will know that that they have been assigned this comment similarly i can go ahead and mention more than one people and i can mention a task as well so let's go ahead and mention a task that i'm talking about so i'm gonna select this third option which is mention a task click on it and it will open up your task list for you. And now I can add the task I am talking about. The task they have to approve. So I'm going to select this one right here. And then I can just simply add this one. They will be able to check this task from here. This is the easiest way to communicate with them and let them know all the details within one comment. Now I can also add an emoji if I like. Let's go with a thumbs up. Then we have slash commands. Now slash command helps us get different commands to our comments, just like we do it in our descriptions. So if I go with slash, then it will allow me to create a checklist, divider, bullet points, table and more. So I can simply convert it to a checklist. Similarly, we have add a file option. This will allow me to upload any kind of file to my comment right here. I can add a drive link, I can add a file, for example, this script that has been written, they have to approve, I can upload the file as well. Once I'm done, I can just go ahead and click on save or comment or I can just click on enter. Once you do that, your comment will be added right here and you can see now I have mentioned a person, assigned this comment to them and added a task, added an emoji and I also added a checklist. This way, they will be able to communicate back and check this list when they're done. They will also be able to comment back and reply to me. And this way, we communicate with our team members within a task on ClickUp. I can also go ahead and edit my comment anytime I like or delete it if I want. So yeah, guys, this is how you can communicate with your team within a task on ClickUp. I hope that I was a big help to you. The link for ClickUp is given in the description down below. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up, turn on bell notification, leave a comment and subscribe to the YouTube channel.